uh, I have wiped the cat feces and poured some water to the area afterwards to purify it. But after that, the water that I have poured spread out on the floor and touched another cat feces. So this all of the poured water that has already spread on the floor become nudges. And if yes, yes, yeah, what should I do? Because when that happened, I only wiped the second cat feces, poured a little water that is not overwhelmed the first one, and my family stepped on it and walked around the house. Jazakallah khair. Get rid of the cat, Akhi. <laughs> Why would you put yourself in trouble with such an animal if it's going to pollute your whole house? First of all, it's permissible to have cats. No problem in that. Second of all, if there are feces of the cat or any other animal that is nudges, first of all, you have to remove the mass, the actual feces, before putting water on it. Putting water does not purify it. You have to remove the actual feces and wipe whatever mass or trace of it. Then, finally, you can pour water that would totally clean and dissolve anything else and remove it. If you did not do this, whatever you put water on both feces, it's going to stay impure. And you have to remove the signs of impurity with the water and wash it and overwhelm it with pure water in order to get this area purified. And Allah Azza wa knows best.